Hello and welcome to Don't Knock Twice. This is a spooky horror game on the Nintendo Switch. It's actually on Steam and PS4 as well, but personally I'm playing the Switch version which came out not too long ago. Now this game is meant to have like a VR aspect to it on Steam and PS4, but unfortunately the Switch does not have any VR capabilities, so we'll just be playing it kind of normal here. Now this game is kind of like a Layers of Fear type game. I don't think it's that long. The Steam version's like 20 bucks, the version on the Switch was only 10, so I got it for that. Now last year, there was a movie called Don't Knock Twice, and this game that just came out this year is a tie-in to a year-old movie, which is kind of strange, and it was also made by an indie company, which I don't know how common indie games tied into movies are, but uh, this is one. Now on Steam, by users, it has pretty good reviews, but by critics, the reviews are terrible, but hey... Don't knock it till you try it, right? But let's just go start the game. Let's just go play and try not to get spooked. I'm not really usually one to get spooked by games, so we'll see what happens here. Oh gosh, the scariest thing of all. Really long loading screens. Oh my gosh, it's it's going slow. You can see the little bar. Oh, oh, there it goes. Yo, go bar, go, yeah. By the way, guys, this is an, a rated M game, which I normally don't play on my channel. So just a heads up, there will be some like swearing from the, in the game, not from me, but in the game. So if that's something you don't want to watch, Definitely tune out now, but just giving you guys a heads up. All right, loading screen's over. Let's go. Oh, okay. I thought it was going to like a load of cutscene or something. I guess we're loading directly in. Oh, gosh. We are very slow, and it is very dark. Oh, gosh. What is this frame rate, dude? Holy crud. Okay, I, I got to turn the brightness up a little bit. I want to put the brightness back to default. I turned it down a little bit. I thought it'd be more spooky, but it's just hard to see. So restore to defaults. There we go. Uh, it's not much better, but hey, I'll, I'll take it. So let's go look around and uh, hopefully not get too spooky. I got, got a little, little thunder and lightning. I don't know if that's the door I can't actually see Ooh, oh we got glowing magazines okay ZR to grab let's go do that oh you have definitely layers of fear style right here oh crud I dropped it oh I see the phone's ringing we can focus in on it and we can flip it around and crud all right okay okay I'll answer the phone oh gosh now that's horrible we've got buttons on our phone what year was this made in leave me the heck alone all right Chloe uh, how do we call her back we don't have any arms okay we put the phone away let's go play on our Oh gosh, is this a MacBook? Pick up the candlestick to illuminate your weight. That sounds wonderful. Where's the candlestick? Can I pick up the booze? No, it was just grape juice. I don't see any candlestick. The problem with dark games, oh, there it is. The problem with dark games though, is it's like I can see every speck of dust on my screen now. I can't like tell you guys how weird the movement is. It's like very floaty and slippery. Okay, let's go stick this candlestick in the fire. Uh, B to crouch, yes. Do have to, okay, we have to crouch into the fire. What the crud is this? Yes, this is very illuminating. Okay, we can press the left stick in to run. That's gonna be helpful. Can we go through the door now? Oh, yes, we can. We can push that door right on open. Let's see, let's go over. Oh. I got an email. Let me check my phone real quick. Why did you turn the power off? I hate you. I didn't do this crud. Wow. I mean, you would think if I was the one who turned the power off, I'd at least be a little bit more prepared. Maybe bring a flashlight instead of a stinking candle. What if I get wax all over my hands, man? Oh, we got a stinking lamp. Okay, I guess the power's off. It's not going to be that useful. I mean, can we just like set the lamp on fire? Maybe that would be handy. Um, we can't pick up the balls. Darn it, man. Why give me, why you show me some golf balls I can't pick up? Let's see. How do we open? I think red means locked, guys. Uh, we can press the button to grab the handle. I think the red circle there means that it is locked, though. So, just something to keep in mind. Man, I really can't see anything, dude. I don't know if you guys can see, I'm, uh, uh, but on my screen, dude, I, I can't see crud. Uh, I think this door is locked. Let me check. Yeah, that door is locked. Let's go back down the hallway. Oh, gosh. We can see ourselves in the mirror. Let's go. Nope. Dude, I don't exist! I'm a stinking glow! I hear someone knocking at the door. I'll go let you in in a second, dude. Let's see, can I focus in? The story behind artist Jessica Webb Thomas. Artist Magazine. How do I drop it? Uh, ZR, okay, cool. Oh, I need my shoes. I can't pick up my shoes. All right, let's go find out who's knocking here. Hello, who's there? Anyone here? Oh, spooky pictures. It's always gotta be spooky pictures, dude. Uh, this thunder. Oh, probably this door. Yeah, we didn't answer the front door. Yeah, let's, let's go over and see who's over here. Um, radio. Okay, don't get distracted. Let's go open the door here. Okay, let's go see who's behind door number one. Wait, wait, right stick to push and pull. Got it. Who's there? Where? Ah, open. There you are. Wait, who is knocking? Wait, did the door just shut behind me? Don't be spooking me, game. Oh, it locked behind me, you crutter. Um, all right, I guess we're locked outside in the rain. I don't know how it's not putting out my candlestick, but hey, I'll, I'll take it, man. What is this? A basketball hoop? That's a giant hoop, dude. That hoop's like so low, even I could dunk in that crud. Okay, the gate over here is locked. Who the crud has a gate, but doesn't own the key to the gate? What is it with these spooky games? We're like in a house and we don't have keys to it. Don't I live here? Why, why don't I have keys? Oh yeah, I forgot I can run. That helps a lot. Okay, this door is locked as well. I'll keep looking. Maybe we have to go and play in the fountain. 
Oh, here we go. We got an email. You're going to dump me again, aren't you? You selfish crutter. Um, Chloe, you need to calm down, Chloe. Jeez. Um, Chloe, did you lock me out? Can you just lock me in? Oh, wait. The game's called Don't Knock Twice. Let's go knock twice. Reverse psychology up in here. Hey, Mr. Door, open. I knocked twice, dude. Come on, Chloe, let me in. Okay, I hear like a dog snoring, maybe. Maybe they can let me in. Maybe the dog can like jump through the window and go and lock the door for me. Come on, Fido, or Lassie, whatever your name is. I'm knocking three times. I'm knocking thrice. Pipe? Oh, this one's open, dude. The whole time this one gate was open. Gosh dang it, me. Uh, that's not a gate. Hi, Mr. Door. Yes, it's open. We can go in, guys. We can actually go through a door. Come on, let me in. Um, I guess I'll grab this book. Oh, stinking painting. Get out of here. Jeez, who put that on the wall? <sighs> You're supposed to hang it with a nail and not with a spring. Let's focus in. Eh. Um, too lazy to try to read that. Oh, crud. We've got triangles and smiley faces. My one weakness. Let's see if any of these other paintings are going to fly off at us. Uh, let's go through this door. This one's open. I'm just kind of going wherever we can, going through whatever door we happen to find. Not really good at opening doors, though. I'm using... Oh, we have to pull it. Right. Okay. Yeah, I've done that before in restaurants, pushing when I should have pulled. Okay, there we go. We got some zebra pillows. I think... Isn't this where we started? Why did I just backtrack? Pretend that didn't happen. Let's just keep exploring this house, I guess. Uh, this door made a squeaky, so maybe we have to go this way. Open door. Open door. Yes, this is a new room. All right. Let's go check out this creepy painting. Oh, wait, there's something glowing. There's something glowing. And sorry about the terrible frame rate, guys. I think that's the Switch version. And not another child goes missing. Uh-oh. I hope I'm not a child. Uh, we can go through that door. Let's explore this room a little bit before we start going through doors and crud. Oh, can we play the stinking piano? Yama... It's not Yamaha, guys. We've got a Yamaha piano. Let's go to this door. That one's locked. Stop ticking clock. Oh, wait. Oh, we can just go upstairs, dude. Is the story of this game that we're a vampire? Because I can't see my reflection in any of these mirrors. Now, let's just go upstairs. What could possibly go wrong up here? Let's go check out the left door. That's locked. Aha, there's something on the table here. Let's go read that. Methadone. What is that? Hyperchloride tablets. Oh, we can press that to read it. There we go. Dissolve the tablet in at least 300 milliliters of water, orange juice, or other citrus flavored non-alcoholic beverage. No! I kind of feel like I should go try to read the other things now. Let me do that real quick. Local boy is one of many children to go missing in recent weeks. He was last seen playing Knock Knock Run with his... Knock Knock Run... Who the crud calls it that? It's ding dong ditch, dude. Or maybe, maybe doorbells didn't exist yet. Uh-oh. Who smudged my wall? They must have been like carrying a tray of chocolate cupcakes up and they got some frosting on the wall. That's just rude. Well, let's see what's in here. Who puts a padlock on their cupboard? Look at this, guys. I can't see me. Well, I guess we'll go over this way then. What is this? I guess it's just some books. Books are kind of scary. I think that's probably the scariest thing we've seen so far is a stack of books. Got another creepy painting here. Man, you would think for someone who can't see themselves in the mirror, why would they spend all the money to buy all of these mirrors? It just doesn't make a lot of sense to me. Okay, this door is already open. Um, no, for a second though, I thought this just took me back to where I already was. So we've already got our candle lit here. Oh, did the door just shut behind me again? Darn it, dude. Man, if we don't have doorbells, how do we have advanced technology like laptops and automatic doors? Oh, no, don't don't close it. Oh, no, I was going to read that. Oh, well, there we go. I got eh, the paper. I was a drug addict. Oh, jeez. Oh, I love you, Chloe, at the end there. They love Chloe. I don't really keep up with the Kardashians myself. Wait, me and Chloe? Oh, I'm gone. No wonder I don't show up in the reflections. I'm, I must be dead. It must be like a spirit spooky. Wait, what kind of soda? What kind of soda do they drink? Oh man, they're drinking key. It's probably like key lime. I doubt I can use that key to unlock some doors, but oh well. Let's just uh, let's just open the door manually. We'll use our arms. Um, uh, boxes. It's just a room full of boxes. We got like a gosh dang it candle. There's plenty of wax. Why'd you go out already? Uh, we got like the Russian dolls here. Is the doll going to attack me? Oh, hold on, gotta check my email. What the heck is going on? Is someone else here? I'm here. Oh, maybe I'm a spook and I'm spooking her? That might be what's happening. I don't know, dude. Is the door working now? It looks like it is. Oh, it's a pull door. It's a pull door, Psycho. Is it? No, it's a push door. Okay. All right, let's uh, go back into the hallway here. Oh, is that Chloe? Chloe! Is she over here? Oh, don't close the door. Dude, let's talk about this. Why do you got to throw a tantrum, dude? Oh, this is the window leading to the uh, courtyard area that we were already in. Come on, Chloe. Open up the the door <laughs> okay okay chloe just walking through walls jeez she's using like some no clip hacks or something dude all right that's that's totally fair let's just go through this door i guess um chloe what are you doing in my house you can't just be doing i was gonna say lots of triangles i guess it's like a star oh but there's a naruto symbol right there you got the swirl i guess this is all right let's go check it out is that a tablet no oh, it's just a picture right uh 
Wait, is that Chloe? Sapphire Art Award winner 2016. Back water from the well to cleanse the souls of the innocent she devours. What? A mortar and pestle? Okay, I don't think that's Chloe. Let's keep exploring a little bit here. How about we go through this door? Nope, it's locked. Oh, look at all these pizzas, dude. Do we even have an oven? I don't got a toaster oven. Oh, someone's an artist. I guess that's probably why they had that picture of art in there. Yeah, I guess all the pizzas are to stay awake. They're probably doing some kind of art project in the middle here. Man, we must be rich. Look at all this stained glass, dude. I can see the moon out that way, but let's go check out this window. It's pretty cool. Oh, someone dropped a goblet. What even is this? Is this like a pooper? Oh, here we go. We can turn the crank. I gotta get that goblet out of there. Who put that in there? Kind of want the crosshair back on. I can't aim at things very well. Hold on. Breaking some immersion. There we go. Oh, yeah. You have to aim exactly at the handle to uh, turn it here. Okay, there we go. Give it a crank. Just spin in the joystick. Oh, I broke it. No, don't fall in. There. Oh, crud. Yeah, it's stuck open now. Well, at least we can grab this uh, chalice or goblet, whatever this thing is. I don't know what use this thing's going to be. Oh, gosh dang it. I hate these stinking vanishing cups, man. It's like I put my drink in them, it just spills everywhere. Okay, well, I guess let's go back to the uh, art project over here. Oh, there it is. Jeez, I thought I lost it. I can't pick it up now. Okay, let's keep looking around this room there. Hmm. Anything in these boxes? Got a lamp right here, but again, no power, so we can't really check anything out there. I'm not really seeing anything. Just lots of old books. Lots of boxes. Lots of dropped frames. Oh, here we go. Yeah, let's go ahead and read this notebook. It's been so rough the past few days. Chloe hates me, and I don't blame her. I'm trying to make it up to her. Trying to make her see that I'm not the same person who was unfit to look after her all those years ago. Letting them take her away from me was the hardest decision I could ever make, but it was the right one. I needed help. Sometimes, even now, when I can't sleep, I ache for another fix. Thank goodness I have my work to distract me. I spent hours last night in the studio working on my latest sculpture. I'm still not totally happy with the concept, but it's slowly getting there. I just wish the same could be said about my relationship with Chloe. Okay, so I thought Chloe was like my lover, and I thought Chloe was doing the art, but I think I'm the artist, and Chloe's probably like my kid, and because I uh, do the dergs, I probably had her taken away by Child Protective Services or something like that. Or maybe I just wanted to get away from her if she was that spooky thing that goes through walls. Let's see if I can go back up the stairs here. Dude, it is really dark over here. Just slowly make our way through. Oh, chairs. Hi, Mr. Door. Okay, we can't open that door. Let's go back downstairs. So we got that one goblet. We probably have to get like five things to line up for this thing here. It's very descriptive. Five things for the thing. Oh, here we go. Got another email. Why are you doing this to me? I wish you were dead. Chloe! I didn't do crud, man. I guess maybe that's the problem. Maybe I should have done something. Okay, let's go. Did the door just close? Stinking door? How could you? <laughs> what? Who's there? Oh gosh, is the statue laughing at me now? Let's take a look. In Slavic folklore, Baba Yaga is a super supernatural being who appears as a deformed, ferocious looking woman. Oh crud, maybe it's not Chloe sneaking around? Okay, oh, just threw it through the wall. <laughs> this is not glitch fest, I swear. Oh crud! Wait, no, don't don't drop it. I need that, I need that. Pick it back up, pick it back up, stick it. Okay, I need crosshairs. I'm just gonna leave it on. I know it's annoying to have it in the middle, but I can't- I can't line stuff up without it. There we go. Oh, now we can kill stuff. Yeah! Bring it on, Chloe! I'm gonna wreck you, bro! Oh, we can use it for light as well. Okay, come on, Chloe. Oh, there's a statue. Am I the one sculpting all this creepy crud? What's wrong with me? Oh, can we burn down this? There we go. Burn down those vines! Yeah! Rip vine. Uh, I got a random head? Alright. Let's, uh, see if we can make our way through here. Hopefully we don't fall through the floor. I think it's just some water on the ground. Let's go burn down more vines. Burn all the things. Aha, we've got like the vine covered gate right here. I, I mean, we can burn down the vines. I don't know how we're going to open those bars though. Wait a second. Can I just grab it? Oh, <laughs> we're going to open it with our arms. Right. Okay. Well, it leads us to this door here. There's also this gate, unless that's where I just came from. Nope, that's a separate gate. So I don't know which one we want to go through. I guess we'll go try the door, which is locked. Of course it is. Don't, don't drop that. I need that still. Man, I can't get over how terrible the stuttering and the frame rate is. I don't know if this is just the Switch version, but wow. <laughs> it's a little rough. Hopefully it's not too hard to watch, though. Got my jiggly, my hairspray right here all jiggly and crud. I feel like we've been here before. Can I burn plants and stuff? Oh, I think I might be out of spray. Oh, maybe it's just because my candle on the spray can went out. Can't do anything there. Oh, the lamp's on in there. Oh, is that Chloe? Chloe! Oh, Chloe. Hey, it's me. Open the door. No, 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 no. Don't go. Don't go to the light, Chloe. Come back here. I'll, I'll spray you. Oh, don't do your stinking magic trick. Who do you think you are? You're not Houdini, bro. Oh, okay. If you say so. <sighs> Chloe always playing these pranks on me. Hmm. Oh, the gate's locked. She locked it behind me as well. Thanks a lot, Chloe. Okay, maybe we can go and open this door then. Maybe it opened now. No, it's still locked. Oh, there we go. So this is the door. I think this is going to lead to where Chloe did her spooky spooks. So let's go on. Let's go on through. Let me in. 
Let me in! Open door. Oh, geez. Stop dropping your spray paint. Or your spray hair. You gotta keep your hair nice and fresh. There you go. Open the door plenty. Now we can squeeze in. Oh, gosh dang it, Chloe. I don't want to talk to you right now after pulling that trick on me. I'm really stinking scared. It's come for me. This is all my fault. What's your fault? What's come for you? At least you don't have a jiggly hairspray can. Now this is true terror. I'm jiggling all over. Maybe that's just because my character's scared, so his hand's trembling. Oh, yeah, the paintings are getting even spookier, man. Can't go through that door. Oh, can we go through here? Yes, good. Let's go on in. Open up. Oh, we got like the pool table room. Dude, I was, I stinking love pool table. Oh, here we go. We can get some info on how we have to do that uh, little ritual thing. Yeah, the summoning ritual. Okay, so we need amethyst, diamond, emerald, ruby, and sapphire. I don't know which one we already got. I think it was either, I think it was spirit. No, maybe it was water. Well, we gotta find some more crud. Let's go ahead and throw this tablet away. And let's take a look at this picture. Chloe, age nine, and her favorite doll, Ruby. Oh, okay. Backfire to cook her cold heart. Uh, oh, can we look at the back if we flip it around? Oh, I see. Okay. So I think her doll is what we have to use for the Ruby part of the summoning ritual. Let's do that. Where's your doll, Chloe? Oh, gosh dang it, man. I'm sorry. Please help. I didn't mean what I said. Okay, I'll help you. Jeez. I think you're totally capable of finishing your math homework all by yourself, but if you need help, I'll do it. Ben Thomas on behalf of Jessica Webb Thomas, to whom it may concern. Um, I, I don't think I'm gonna read all this out loud. You guys can pause read if you want. I'll read through it on my own though. Okay, so what I think this is, is there was probably a custody battle and we're the dad who won custody. And I think they're saying that they didn't let the mom see Chloe and that was a bad decision. Something like that, maybe. Can we burn this? Can I like toss it into the fire? Uh, no, this is some indestructible paper here. Let me see if I can relight my hairspray. Come on, light it up. I think we're gone. Okay, we're gonna get rid of the hairspray. I think we're done with that. Oh, we got a ball. Can't do anything with it. Um, we could, we could play some darts. I guess we can go through this door over here, maybe? Uh, yes, we can. Let's go. So we gotta go try to find her doll, wherever that might be. Oh, here, we're back to the golf balls. We've been through here already. I think... Oh, gosh dang it, Chloe. What's happening to me? In the kitchen, the doll, it burns! Okay, so the doll's in the kitchen. Thanks, Chloe. We'll be right there. I actually don't know where the kitchen is, so that's kind of a problem. It's not through there, apparently. Maybe it's through this door. Aha, okay. Where are you, kitchen? I never thought I would spend my days looking for a kitchen, but I guess that's what we're doing today. Maybe through here? Aha. Is that you in there, Chloe? I kind of hear something. I don't know. This is more like a dining room. Oh, stinking automatic doors. Oh, who the crud knocked over the fridge? Chloe, come on, man. Okay, so this is definitely the kitchen. Let's go check out inside the fridge. Maybe in the freezer. No, nothing in there. Okay, where's the doll? We need the doll for the ruby to do the summoning ritual. Uh, oh, it's probably in the fire, isn't it? Okay, let's go check that out. Let's just crouch down. Oh, but it's locked. I see the doll right there. We need that crud, but it is locked. How are we going to open this? Dude, the ruby's going to burn. Oh, we can't use a spatula. There's that doll again. Can we grab that? Yes, okay. Maybe we can throw this at the at the fireplace? Or at the uh, oven? Open! No, no, no! Oh, crud, what have I done? Okay, I didn't mean to do that. That was an accident. Yeah, I didn't mean for that crud to dematerialize, but I guess that's just what I'm good at. Let's grab the book here. Give it a read. There was a young woman bullied and teased by all other people in her village. She was always alone and longed to be a mother and have a child to love and care for. As she grew older, she became more and more of a recluse. Children used to prank her, knowing she yearned for a child and would knock on her front door and run away. It is said that this is what drove her insane. In her insanity, she made a deal with a demon. That demon being the Baba Yaga. A deal was made to grant the woman a wish, a child. In doing so, she had to serve the Baba Yaga by making sacrifices to her. As the village children taunted her, she sought revenge on them by putting a curse on her front door. By doing so, condemning the child who knocked her door to be the chosen sacrifice for the Baba Yaga. So basically, if you knock on the door, you're gonna get sacrificed, so maybe don't knock on the door, and especially don't knock twice. You can use the axe to open locked doors by chopping the handles off. Oh, what? Where do I get an axe from? Oh, there it is. Yeah. All right, Mr. Door. Here he comes. Ooh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, there we go. Knock that crud open. So now how do we how do we open it with no handle now? Crud, is it a pull door? Oh, there we go. I don't know what we're pulling on, but that is a pull door. Okay, let's go right through. And what is this? Okay, we're going beyond the brick wall, guys. Let's just go check it out. See what's in here. Hopefully, uh, this doesn't collapse in on me. I don't think we're gonna have any phone service. Well, I guess we've been calling Chloe, so we can still call 911, no problem. Uh, we have to wrench this, but with our axe, I guess? No, 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 I need that axe, but let's see if we can grab this real quick. There we go. Oh, push that valve. Good. Okay, let's keep the axe with us. 
and swing it at the wall. I think I just turned off the fire that was in the kitchen. So maybe we can now go get the doll. Uh, let's see. Yep, okay. I don't know why it's locked when the when it's on, but yeah, let's go ahead and open this now. There we go, and now we can- oh, don't close it back up. Let's open it carefully. There we go. Oh, you guys don't understand how difficult it is to use the controls. Just get the stinking doll. There we go, we got the doll. Okay, so now that we have this, I don't- oh, jeez. I was gonna say I don't know what to do with it. It's just gonna dematerialize again. So it might have ended up back at the triangle room. Or the star room. But with this fridge in the way, I don't know how we're gonna get through here. I don't know how we're gonna do this one, guys. I think we're stuck forever. Unless we can go back in here, maybe? Now, here's someone playing some music. I mean, I like all kinds of music, but more of a metal guy myself. Not really into this whole, uh, slow, classical-type sound. I mean, it's, it's still pretty good, though. Just not my favorite. Get out of my way, Fridge. Oh, there we go, there we go. Ooh! Ooh! I feel like this is brute force method to a simple problem. Can't quite seem to get on top of the fridge to get the rest of it. Oh, there we go, okay. Jeez, so you had to axe down that wall. Wow. I don't... I don't know, I don't, oh crud! I don't know how we're meant to uh, figure that one out. I'm not sure if that was the Yaga Baba. I don't think we have any health bar in this game, so I'm not sure if, I'm not sure if this game has like a you lose kind of state. Not really sure about that. Okay, let's go through here. What could possibly go wrong? Come on, Mr. Yaga Baba. I got my candle, I got my axe. I can wreck you. Kinda wish I still had my hairspray. Oh, we can't axe down the paintings, man. Man, that's a lot of jackets. How many people live here? Ha, I'm not gonna be blocked by a stinking door. Haha! -ha, we can open any doors now since we got this axe. And what happens if you just like lose the axe? Okay, let's open it on up. There we go. I think we might be going back to the sculpture room because we got the the doll for that. So yeah, let's go check that room back out. Oh, we got another one of these stinking uh, Matroshka dolls. Will it dematerialize again? I guess I'll just hold on to it. Let's focus on it. Flip it around. Okay, if you swing at it, it uh, dematerializes. Why is my turning so slow? Look at this! Oh my gosh, my camera sensitivity! I think it glitched out because I was staring at the the doll when I broke it. So now my- oh my gosh, look how slow- I'm pushing as hard as I can to the side. Well, hopefully I don't get attacked because my camera is extremely slow right now. Don't mind me, let me just turn around real quick. Just turn it around. Oh gosh, walking is a pain now. I don't know what I did, but I think my camera's fixed. Cool. Uh, we can break this handle now. Yes. Break it. Break it, buddy. Oh, come on. Break that crud. There you go. You did it. Oh, I think this is where the music is coming from. Oh, it's the bathroom. Ew! Someone took a poop in the bathtub. Who did that crud? Oh, I guess their body decomposed. Why are you a skull in there? That's just a little creepy. Okay, let's go ahead and grab that. Oh, Mr. Arms, get out of here. I'm trying to grab a skull. Uh, can we focus on it? Nope. Oh, I guess I threw it. Oh, look at this picture. That's nice. Let's grab that. Uh, the front, Ben and Jessica's engagement, two, 2012. And then Steam reveals the secret to air. I should probably be paying attention to these like little... Oh, don't throw it in the toilet, dude. These little notes like this, I should probably be paying attention to that, shouldn't I? Steam reveals the secret to air. Hmm, gotta figure out how to do some steam. Let's go ahead and axe this doll. Boom. Get some more poof poofs. I don't know what those are for, but they seem important. Dude, that is a weird looking toilet. Someone needs to plunge that crud. <laughs> Literally. So steam reveals the secret to air. Do you have to get like a tea kettle? Let me check out that skull a little bit better. Yeah, that's a, that's a skull. Okay, I'm just, I'm trying to find that sculpture room again. Oh, we can break open this door. Let's, let's go check that out as well. Uh, we're back in the bedroom, I think. Yeah. But it was locked, so there might be something more. There's another axe? How many axes can we ha Can we dual wield axes, dude? I don't think we can dual wield, but we can check this out. Folklore of the Baba Yaga tells of the servant's curse. The bearer of the necklace shall do the demon's bidding. The evil hag's powers are limited on earth, and she needs the help of a human slave or cursed soul to carry out her commands. It is said that the only way the servant can be free of the demon is if they kill themselves or if they trick someone else into replacing them by doing something truly evil. Ew. What is that reflection? That's so weird weird looking. I don't know if that's an intentional weird look or if they just did a poor job modeling the reflection thing. I don't know, man. Oh, TV came on. Okay. It looks like we got our power back at least. Uh, it's just some snow. I hear some noises though. I guess the speaker's kind of working, but not really. Well, let's go see if we can open the safe at least. Oh, okay. We got a four number combo we have to think of. Let me go check the TV, see if it has the combo for us. No, I don't think so. I think it's just being a TV. I'm gonna bust down this door. Property damage, yeah! Oh, you know what code I'm gonna try? Okay, we got one, five, there you go, 15. It's wrong. Okay, one, three, three, seven, it's gotta work. It doesn't work. Well, if we find a code, we'll, we know where to come with it. So we'll just uh, keep that in mind. Let's see if we can bust off that padlock, we can. Okay, let's open this one up. We got another one of these stinking dolls. I'll just keep breaking them and uh, maybe something cool will happen. I don't know if that's what you're meant to do, but it 
feels like it's what you're meant to do, so I don't know. Okay, let's just keep keep going on our adventure here. Oh, here's some more creaking. Oh yeah, I forgot about Chloe. She hasn't called me in a long time, has she? What do you guys feel about the frame rate? Do you think it makes it more spooky or do you think it ruins the experience? I don't know, man, but I don't know if the frame rate's this bad on the other versions, but the Switch version, whew. I mean, it's not that bad, but it is kind of jittery. Get out of here, Mr. Book! You know, they say that people never smile in those old pictures, but this guy's definitely smiling. Oh, this door's open. Oh, yes, there it is! We're in the room! Okay. And yes, the doll's right there, so we've got two of the five things that we need done now. Yes, just gotta get three more, it looks like. Now, we saw a riddle for the air, having to do with steam. But I don't know what that means. I think we saw a clue for the fire, but we already got the fire here, so that's not nothing to worry about. So how could we do steam? I feel like it's got to be something to do with the tea kettle, right? I hope that I can actually beat the game. I mean, I am on the Switch version. I'm not playing the steam version, so I don't know if I can do the steam puzzle. Oh, this is a locked door. Let's go in there. Boom. Whenever I see a locked door with a handle I could actually break, I get so excited, man. Okay, we got some candles down here, so maybe someone's just kind of chilling down here waiting for us. Let's go see if this is where Chloe's hiding. And I guess I'll check out this uh, piece of paper as well. Passed down generation to generation, a tale has been told of a child that strayed too far from their mother in the forest. The child came across a house, the front door guarded by a horned goat. The goat leads the child inside, never to return again. An old woman has been seen wandering the forest for lost children to lead them to the house. The story always changes, but the goat remains the constant. Okay, that's a good story. Let's go ahead and set that one down. Let's keep exploring, dude. I think this is not somewhere we've been. Oh, we might be able to break these as well. Yes! Oh, gosh. Finally somewhere else we can explore. This is great. Let's knock all these planks down. There we go. Very dusty. Very dusty down here. Probably does not get a lot of foot traffic, I guess. I'm not sure if I can walk into that pit right there. I'm not gonna risk it. We'll just uh, leave that one aside. I keep saying press R to read, but it's like, what can I read? I think it's glitched and it's meant it's meant to say R to swing. A little bit of a buggy game. What's that? Oh, it's a motor. Oh, it's a generator. Maybe we can get our power back. Yes. Oh, yeah. We're gonna get electricity back. Nice, dude. And we get another axe. I still don't think we can dual wield these things. I also just realized I don't have my candle. There it is. Okay. Ooh, the light's on. Nice. And it lights up the way here. Um... Well, I kind of already went this way. I don't know. Should we go down, guys? I guess we're gonna try. No, it, there's like an invisible wall. We can't go down there. Oh, there we go. I think we can go this way. Yes, we can carefully walk along the side. Wait, stuck. Maybe I can't go this way? Oh, I see. There's a crank right here. Okay, let's go ahead and turn this crank. Oh, oh, oh. Come on, come on. Oh, jeez. Yeah, there we go. I don't know. I think this might be lowering some kind of bridge. Oh, we broke it again. There we go. We can get across. Good. Okay, what are we going to find over here? I got another axe and another one of these dolls. Oh, did I lose my axe? Oh, that's my axe. Whoops. Okay, let's go ahead and break the doll then. Another picture of Chloe? Chloe playing dress up with my tiara at the back. Pull the stones to unearth her rotten flesh. I somehow have my candle and my phone out right now. I'm trying so hard not to break the game, guys. I'm not doing this on purpose. I just can't help it. There we go. We can put the phone away, keep the candle out. Yeah, no, no. There we go, good. And I hope Chloe calls me again soon or texts me because she hasn't done so in a while. Oh, do we have to pull these stones? Nope. Oh, I see, I see. Okay, it's this one. So grab that. There we go, good. Do we have to do it one by one, I think? Oh, I see something in there. Okay, we'll get rid of the stone. Can we pull anything more? No, I see, I see it. Okay, there's like a tiara. Can't get those out of here. There we go. Controls for this are so, so weird. Oh, jeez. It's just like bouncing all over. Dropping my axe in the mud. The button to drop your axe is the same button as the button to pick something up. So I keep accidentally dropping it instead of picking something up. There we go. So we got the tiara. I think that's the third piece of the puzzle, dude. I think we only need two more. Awesome, we got it. And there it goes, dematerializing. Ladies and gentlemen, just two pieces to go to solve this puzzle. Okay, let's get back across this wood plank. Hopefully it won't break while we're on top of it. Oh, wait. Do you guys hear that? Is that Chloe? Chloe! Chloe! Is that you, dude? Oh, the generator went off too. Great. How am I gonna do my laundry? How am I gonna do my laundry, man? Chloe? Is that... Is that Chloe's? Oh, I saw that basketball earlier. Can I pick that up? Okay, we can pick the ball. I'll bring it back to her, guys. I'll, I'll do my best to bring it back to her. No, stop dropping your stinking axe. Chloe, I'm coming. I've got your basketball. I'm gonna bring it back to you. We can play. I know we got the hoop outside. We can do some slam dunkies. We can do some slam dunkies, man. Oh, crud. Oh, jeez. I'm not doing that. I'm not dribbling. I'm not dribbling on the door. Okay, Chloe, your ball ran away. I'm just gonna leave it, all right? Let's go ahead and pull this door open. Oh, jeez. Why are these doors all pull doors? Come on. Pull open. There we go. Oh, jeez, it's so dark in here. I was getting excited. We got that generator. I thought maybe we'd get some power back. Maybe we do have to bring the ball outside and dunk it. Yeah, we're, we are going back outside. Okay, I'm gonna go get your ball, Chloe. Where'd the ball go? Oh, it's back there. It's behind the sewing machine, dude. Can't get it. No! I bet you there's like a Steam achievement to dunk that, but uh, this is the Nintendo Switch version. We don't have achievements, so let's just, let's just go out. I... 
doubt we actually need that. If we do, I think I might have just broke the game, but I'm guessing that we probably won't need that. Okay, so this is the tiara we got. We still need two more. We need the air. Which we got the clue to the air before, but I didn't actually get it. So something to do with steam. And then we have that eyeball. I'll just walk around. Oh, oh, gee. oh, there's steam. Steam. Yes. Okay, so the radiator just bursted. So maybe we're onto something. Is this someone's Facebook page? Darn it, Ben Thomas. Man, the radiator popping kind of made me feel like I was onto something, but I don't know. Oh. Is that you, Chloe? I didn't know you were that young. Okay, we'll break this doll at least. Yeah, okay, let's go check out different parts of the house. Maybe go back to where that piano was. Is this wall breakable? It looks like it is. Maybe it's just a bad paint job. I don't know. Look at the fire in the reflection. There's the piano. Finally, we found it. Okay. Oh, dude, don't be don't be ashamed just because I'm here. You can keep playing, man. Just keep playing. Okay, let's check out this picture. Jess and baby Chloe, happy times. The back. The right note is the key to find the spirit of the servant. Okay, the right key. So we have to use the axe, I think, to break it open. There we go. Oh, is that the one? The one right there with the blood on it? Or the cupcake sauce? Got it. Aha! Oh, it turned the lights on. Yes, let's go check it out. Okay. Oh, it opened up the wall. That's kind of surprising. And it takes us to the bathroom. Now oh, did the wall close behind us? Oh, this is some Scooby-Doo crud up in here, man. Got some fragile boxes with candles lit on them. Another one of these toilets, someone left their shoes behind. That's just kind of rude. The boogeyman! Looks like we're low on toilet paper as well. No, no, there's a full roll there. Aha, we got another one of these dolls. Let's pick that up. Break it open! I've got a feeling those are probably tied to some kind of achievement again. But again, the Switch version doesn't have achievements, so even if it is, you can't really do much with that. Oh, power, power! I can't mess with it. No, there we go. Boom! Hit that power! Okay, I think we turned the lights back on. Oh, it just opened up like the attic? Uh, okay. I guess we'll go to the attic. Maybe that is just like a secret switch to, uh, go turn the power switch on upstairs, maybe? Aha! There we go! So we get another can of hairspray, which I guess we'll take with us, but we also get this crud. Oh, there's a spoiler. Oh, you know what? Let's use this to burn the spoilers. Uh, let me see if I can get rid of my axe real quick. I think my axe just went through the floor, but let me grab this real quick, actually. I want this to dematerialize. Hopefully it- Oh gosh, it's glitching! It's glitching! Wait, there it goes, okay. I don't know what we have to burn. I just want to burn the spiders. Uh, oh, we have to burn the spider webs, I bet. No? Oh, there we go, they burned. Good. We got, like, some, uh, cake frosting footprints on the floor. But yeah, we got four items, guys. We just need the one more from the steam thing. So we're almost there. Let's just go ahead and burn down these spider webs here. Oh, we're back in the room with the safe. I don't- I feel like the safe's gonna be important for something, but what? Cool, we got auto automatic doors in here. I've already been in the bathroom, though. There's flies this time, though. I don't think the flies were here last time, were they? I'm just gonna take this skull with me. He's my friend. Can I mess with, like, the faucet? I guess not only is the power out, but the water is out as well. Oh, there we go. We can actually turn the faucet on. Wow, I probably could have done this so long ago. There's the steam. I bet you this is gonna lead to the, uh, the fifth item. I feel so dumb for missing this earlier, but yeah, let's go ahead and turn this water on. I think it's as high as we can turn it. Let me go see if we can turn the water in the tub on as well. Gosh, it's so jittery. Just moving around is like skipping everywhere. Oh wait, here we go. Yes, 4862. So it steams up the mirror. We can see the combo. Nice. Let's go back to the to the safe. 4862. 4862. I got it. Can we get the final item? Let's go. 486 and 2. All right, it's unlocked. Let's go ahead and open it. Oh, whose hand was that? Chloe, stop messing with me, buddy. Oh, we got the beautiful diamond ring. There we go. All right. Oh, why is there like weird shadowy stuff? Okay, so we got the final item. Let's go and uh, go back to the star room, I guess. Oh, there's a lot of gross sounds in crud. Oh, wow, Chloe's calling me again or texting me. You have them all. You've got to come now. I think it's coming back for you. Who's coming back for me? What are you talking about? The Yaga Baba only goes for children. I'm not a child. Got nothing to worry about. Let's just, let's just make our way back. Everything's fine. I think the only problem is I'm a little bit directionally challenged, so I don't remember where the room is. So I'll, I'll just wander around for a while and we'll find it. I'm sure we'll find it. Oh, it was down here, wasn't it? Wow, did I just go right to it? Dude, I'm so good at video games. Forget getting lost. I got this, man. Okay, so we have all five items. Now what? Do we have to go mess with the uh, stuff in the middle? Oh, here we go. I think it's working. Oh, I don't have my axe, though. If we have to fight a boss right now and I have no weapon, that might be a little bit bad. I can't move right now. Oh, yeah, I can. Oh, we have to go through the gates of heck, maybe? Oh, it's the door. And we should not knock twice. Or should we? I'm gonna do it, guys. Let's knock twice. Boom. Boom. Knocked twice. Take that, game. You don't scare me. Oh. Okay, don't know where we are now. I guess we'll just go right on through here. Maybe there's some stuff to explore on the sides. Oh, wait. Do I have to go find a... Hairspray. Okay, we'll go find some hairspray. No big deal. Um, now oh, the door's gonna close on me. Crud. So we can't go back through there. What if we knock from the other side? No, that doesn't work either. Guys, I'm an idiot. There's a can of hairspray right there. 
Let's go grab that. Okay, let's go ahead and spray down the vines and maybe we can get to the bottom of this. Hopefully not to the bottom of a, a pit full of spikes or anything like that. Uh, run? Oh gosh, okay. I, I'm not a very fast runner, but I'll try. Oh gosh, how can I run when there's vines in the way? I don't know if there's anything behind me, but I'm, I'm just gonna keep looking forward. Get a little tunnel vision. Just, just walk forward. Okay, I'll look behind me. I'll do it. Okay, the door's open. There's nothing really spooky back there. No need to run. Creepy blocks. Don't need to don't need to give me these warnings. I mean, I am going to run just to save some time, but oh, we got a cage here. Wait, is that Chloe? Chloe! Oh crud. Okay, let's get the let's get the rope. Can we burn it? Okay, burn that rope. Come on, Chloe. We got you, dude. Oh crud. Um, okay, she might have just died. I can't move. I can't move, Chloe. Okay, Chloe's getting up. Chloe! Aw, oh, nuts. Where's that coming from? Uh, I guess we just watch Chloe. Oh no! Am I the Yaga Baba? Oh, it vanished. I was trying to look at you, dude. Oh, can we run? Okay, let's go chase down Chloe. Come on, Chloe. We'll tag team this crudder. We'll hit him with, like, the dropkick suplex, man. We can do this crud. Dude, wait. How many Yaga Babas are there? Okay, I'm coming, Chloe. I'm coming, Chloe. Just don't, don't worry. Don't worry, Chloe. I'm coming. Those arms are trying to get me, man. It's okay. Oh, you crudder. You crutter. Here, I'm knocking. Okay, I can't knock. I'm caged. Am I taking Chloe's place? Come on, Yaga Baba. I'm not even a kid. I just turned 26, like, two weeks ago. Not even two weeks ago, man. I can't turn my camera. Um, I'd, I'd appreciate it if you'd, like, be nice to me. We could be friends. We can talk through this. It'd be cool if you didn't, like, e eat my face. Just don't do that. Can I turn yet? I cannot turn. I guess we're just stuck in this cage forever. This is the game, guys. Am I missing something? I feel like I should be doing something. What if we... Oh, we can crouch. Yes, dude, there's a there's a hairspray down there, but my camera's stuck. I can't move my camera at all. I think my game is glitched. I think my game is glitched. I can't do anything. I can't I can't turn my camera. What if I pause? No, I can't look down. Don't tell me my game is glitched and I can't keep going. This is evil. No! I can't believe this, dude. I am so upset right now. I can't stink and turn my camera! I hate to do it, guys, but we have to exit to menu and hope, just hope that we'll come back not too far from where we were. Continue. Please work. Okay, we're back at this section. Okay, so let me do this section again, guys. Let's burn that crud down. I have to go through the spooky spooks again. Why? Hi, Mr. Hand. I'm just gonna keep my hairspray this whole time, and maybe I won't have to worry about picking a new can up off the floor. I'm coming, Chloe. I'm coming. Okay, so the door shuts. I'm gonna keep spinning my camera. Maybe if I keep spinning my camera, it'll uh, let me keep rotating. Look, there's an axe right there. I can move. Okay, we got a, we got a text as well. Kill her? Oh, you got it, dude. I got this crud. So pick up the axe. Do I want the axe or do I want the hairspray, though? I guess we're do we're gonna do the axe, guys. Let's put away our phone. Get our candle back out. Yeah! Bring it on, you crud! I got my axe! Oh, get those hands! Get those hands! Yo, yeah, you wanna come back for round two? You going down, Mr. Hand! Or Miss Hand, Yaga Boa Boa, whatever you are. Yeah, round three. Oh, come here. Oh, oh, oh! Yeah, get out of here! I guess it wasn't Cupcake Frosting this whole time. It's been your blood, bro! Yeah! Oh. Um, do I, do I win? Oh, Chloe! Wait, wait, is it not Chloe texting me? Chloe's dead. You're mine? Who's unknown? I'm getting talked to by Pokemon now. Okay, still got my axe. I can't move, though. That is a small problem. Oh, getting a little bit dark right here. Nah, that's okay. Um, <laughs> Whales Interactive! Thanks a lot, guys. Well... I guess that is it for Don't Knock Twice. What a buggy, laggy, jittery mess that was, but still kind of fun. I like the game itself, as simple as it was, but not this version, man. If you guys are interested in picking this game up, maybe go look into the PS4 or the Steam version. Find out if those versions uh, have less problems. Do not get the Switch version unless they patch it, because that is, well, I guess unless you don't care about bugs and glitches and stuff, but, and uh, lag and all that. But yeah, all glitches aside, I had a good time, and I hope you guys did as well. But I guess that is going to be it for today. We'll come back tomorrow and do some more spooky games. I'll see you all then. Take care.